this is how to with Mandy Shu, and today we're doing how to clean your oven with just baking soda and water. It's super easy. I've done it before, and if you're like me, every time you open the door, the neighbors know you're cooking because you set the uh, alarm off. So um, here's what you're gonna need: is a bowl to mix the baking soda in. This is what you're gonna use. Uh, you're gonna just use water. Um, there's some sponges and a spray bottle if you'd like to use it too. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is in the bowl, you're just gonna put a bunch of baking soda in, depending on how much. Uh, Dirt is in your oven and grime. You can use half a box, you can use the whole box. And you pour the water in. Just make a nice paste. You can even it out. You can make more as you go. Just enough to coat the inside of the oven. So I'm just gonna add a little bit more. There you go, see how it's getting a little bit thicker. One more time. So I've used almost half a box, 250 grams or so. There we go, that's better. Okay, we're ready. I had to put my hair up for this. So we're ready, so we have our, our mixture and the oven. So <laughs> to, I guess, avoid getting it all over yourself, go from the back, work your way out. So what you're gonna do is, you can use anything really to spread it if you like, whatever you're comfortable with. Um, I'm using the sponge, and you just kinda cake it on. And it's just gonna stick there. I'm probably gonna have to make more as I go. <laughs> Matt so graciously offered his oven. So yeah, you're just gonna spread it. So now you'll have a nice coated oven um, and the hardest part now is just the waiting. You just have to wait depending on what you're comfortable with. 8 to 12 hours is what I, I've done. If it's more, maybe 14, you can try to push it um, and you just wait. It's good to do it on a, an evening and into the morning so that way you, know, you definitely aren't using the oven. And now you wait and then we'll clean it up tomorrow. So we're back. It's been about 12 hours and we've let the baking soda and water kind of soak. It's uh, kind of stiff and hard. So now what we're going to do is um, with the water, you can use a spray bottle, you can use a wet rag or even vinegar if you want. Both work. I, I use just water and you're going to spray it all down, scrub it out, wash it out and you're done. Ruby scrubs. So that's it. After some scrubbing between half an hour, 45 minutes or so, the oven is pretty much clean. I just have some smaller things to scrub, but as you can see, the baking soda water really helped. Vinegar actually really did well with the baking soda. It reacted and it came off a lot easier than I thought it would. So if you want to use vinegar, you can. So that's how to with Mandy Shu, how to clean your oven.